it might be the biggest feature of politics in the social media age. It's called an echo chamber, or a filter bubble. What it means is that online, you tend to see things you already agree with. Over time, that might solidify your opinions. It might make you less open-minded and unable to see things from the other side. The effect is mostly caused by two things. The first is your friends. You're likely to agree more with the people who you like and follow on social media. That's not new. We've always tended to agree more with our family, friends and neighbors. But the other cause of the filter bubble effect is more recent. It's the way algorithms used by social networks tend to show us things we've already shown an interest in. So if you click on links from a particular political party, America first. Facebook will show you more of the same and less of what you don't click on. That's how the social media powered filter bubble forms. So, how do you get out of your filter bubble? One way is simple. Read stuff from the other side. If you're right wing, check out left wing accounts or vice versa. You can also fool the algorithms. Start liking things you disagree with and commenting on posts you wouldn't ordinarily read. Do that enough and you might see stuff you would have missed new angles on stories you've heard before, or whole new things you didn't know anything about. What will that give you? Well, you might find yourself understanding people with different points of view. You will probably be less shocked if your side doesn't win. You might even find yourself changing your mind.